In an interview Monday, Mr. Wan raised concerns about possible scenarios in which the workplace do not adhere to control and prevention standards stipulated by the Ministry of Health. Mr. Wan questioned the protection and victimization of employees who may face such instances. One of the unfortunate things is that COVID came around while the Occupational Safety and Health Bill was being drafted. Yes. And as a matter of fact, I'm going right now after this interview to the Joint Select Committee uh, considering the Occupational Safety and Health Bill. And we're going to be trying to make sure that there's some reference to pandemics in there because there wasn't and then what kinds of things you know would be advisable to have in there regarding pandemics and the thing you just mentioned simone could be something that's mentioned there to give the employees some level of um, comfort and ability to speak to the employer. Prime Minister Andrew Holness on Sunday made the announcement that the stay-at-home orders were lifted, which saw Jamaicans returning to the workplace on June 1. Since the COVID-19 pandemic, the speedy passage of the bill has been lobbied by trade union leaders. Stevie Winter, Frontline News.